Alright, y'all, let's check out this clean 1991 Cadillac Bomb D'Elegance. She got a set of 22 inch spokes and bows. This really was the last full size Cadillacs before they start downsizing. And if you ever rode in one, you know they ride absolutely amazing. She is clean. She got the 305 cubic inch, five liter V8, backed by a four speed automatic. Of course, she has power brakes, power steering, AC, cruise control. Paint in good condition. Frame and floor pans are solid. And she has all the options. Power windows, power locks, digital gauge cluster. She has a rip here in the driver's seat, but that's minor. These seats are so comfortable. It feel like you're on a leather couch just floating. If you ever rode in one, y'all know the feeling. They just don't make them like this anymore. Just think, if it had all of the new technology of today in this body style, it'd be badass. Back seat, nice and clean. Package tray in good condition. She can use a headliner. Let's take a look at the engine bay. That's the stock 305 cubic inch 5 liter V8. She's backed by a four speed automatic, power brakes. She got power steering, AC, cruise control. Check it out. She does have the lamp monitors for your turn signals. Let's go start her up. Slide right up. As y'all can see, mileage reads a little over 15,000. Nice and smooth. Go check out rollermuseums.com. We got over a hundred detailed photos. If you want a more detailed video, go visit Roller Museum's YouTube channel. 
check out, out all the nice car reviews. Next, let's take a look at this 1996 Chevy Impala SS. She has a set of 22 inch Quartz Classic reps. And this was the last of the full size GMB bodies. Body on frame, rear wheel drive, big engine bay. And this is the car that paved the way for your four door muscle cars up today, like your Dodge Chargers. It was built on the 9C1 police package. And it got the LT1350 V8 from the Corvette. The main difference being the Corvette engine had aluminum cylinder heads, and these got cast iron heads. They came with the G80 Posi track rear end, 308 gears, dual exhaust. The paint is in good condition. Frame and floor pans are solid, lower doors are solid. She got bucket seats, SS embroidered headrest, console with floor mounted shifter. I remember when I was young and I was watching all about the Benjamins and Ice Cube was driving one and I just fell in love with them. They nice and sleek. She has power windows, power locks. She has a little over 43,000 miles. Seat show minor wear. Hairliner good. Upper dash, lower, back seat nice and clean. Package tray. Let's check out the engine bay. That's the stock 350 cubic inch 5.7 liter LT1 V8 backed by a four speed automatic. It's got power brakes, power steering, AC, cruise control, all the creature comforts. Let's fire her up. As I can see, she reads a little over 43,000. Make sure y'all check out rollermuseums.com. We got over 100 detailed photos. If you want a more detailed video, make sure y'all go visit Roller Museum's YouTube channel and check out all the car reviews.